That's rhythm and blues, New Orleans style, courtesy of coding. Yes, coding. So what exactly is coding? Coding is a way of programming. So there's different, different languages in computer sciences, such as JavaScript, Python, uh, et cetera. And um, coding is just like the actual writing out of like all the programs. In short, codes tell the computer what to do. That was Alan Toussaint um, that we just we just heard. Zhao Zhao, an MIT PhD student, created the code for her piano to play on its own. And she's showing off her work to some visiting high schoolers taking part in the Girls Who Code summer camp, which was created to close the gender gap in technology. It was founded back in 2012, and Girls Who Code has grown rapidly. This year, there are about 1,200 girls in camps across the country. In Massachusetts, about 120 girls are participating at companies like Akamai Technologies in Cambridge. It's like a really fun experience. It's fun, but not easy. Girls like Ketki Puhar commit their entire summer to learn computer programming and presentation skills, and they're paired with volunteer mentors who help with their career goals. My goal good software engineer and I uh, hope to work at Google or Microsoft. And it's called Girls Who Code for a reason. Men outnumber women more than five to one in the industry right now. I feel like it's really frustrating because I feel like girls can do just as much as guys. Girls Who Code COO Solomon Steplight says it starts in school. Over time, particularly when you get to middle school, in high school, you start to notice that there's more and more boys in the math and science classes. So far, Solomon and his team have been very successful. 90% of the girls who participated in camps last year went on to major or minor in computer science. The sooner you can get people into the pipeline, the better. So it's about access, right? So if I've never heard of coding, I have no way to get into the pipeline. Prisca Joseph may have been shy in computer science class before, but this summer she's making friends. I can find so many connections and so many people. And the connections can pay off. The average starting salary for someone in computer science is around $70,000, and the demand is high. That's pretty good. I mean, I don't know money at all, but that sounded like a lot. So. <laughs> If they stay on course, being in high demand is a code these girls will live by. Tina Martin, WGBH News.